high school, you get bullied a lot, but our teachers don't do anything about what's going on. I think that the teachers not responding shows they don't care. We're sending messages to our students constantly. And what we say and what we don't say and what we do and what we don't do, I mean, they pick up on, they notice. It is the reality. So you don't have to agree with it or do anything in support of it other than recognizing that it is real and therefore it is something that you have to think about when you are planning on teaching children how to learn and be in this world. Well, we got asked why we would think you wouldn't stand up, but why do you think you wouldn't stand up? The fear of, of saying things that these kids are you know, going to take, and that's great, but then they're also going to take it to their parents, and, and it's the fear of getting fired. I mean, you can be fired. lives are at stake and if you're becoming a teacher you really have to persevere with every issue if that's race sexual identity girls boys everything you just have to work hard and make sure that everyone's feeling accepted incorporate LGBT stuff and normalize it from the very beginning because kids who grow up in accepting environments are going to be more accepting adults a lot of times family and teachers would maybe feel more comfortable making comments if they didn't think a queer student necessarily was around. But you never necessarily know, and sometimes students don't know yet, and that affects their, their development. This is the vote to challenge it because if you're laying the framework and you're building allies with tomorrow, those are the kids that can support kids that are being bullied.